Okay, so this is the test. This is a video where I'll be testing the electroless nickel and the two-part silver solution. That two-part silver solution is used to make uh, to, as, a, as a spray on chrome system to deposit a very shiny, very reflective, uh, almost chrome-like surface on uh, 3D prints, plastics, and other objects. So right now what I'm going to do is I'll be testing the the um, uh, the nickel first. These spoons are in the sensitizers, the sensitizer solution that is um, stannous chloride. I'll be using those in the silver and silver and solution to coat it with silver. And this one are on the activator solution, which is palladium chloride. Now they also they were here a few minutes ago, but I I washed them on the first wash, second wash, and the pal palladium chloride activator. So right now I'm gonna go ahead and use this process. I'm gonna show it to you. Okay, now we're going to deposit nickel on it. You see, it is beautiful and is reflective and uh, very quick, very beautiful. I want to use it, the, I will wash it and put it aside, okay. I'm going to use the second one. Well, that is being coated. I am going to um I'm going to be depositing the silver. So here's the silver. The silver the silver piece. I mean the the pieces that are ready to be silvered. I'm going to wash them. Okay, I'm going to wash them, and then I'm going to uh, be placing them on the, on, this is the reducer, all right, this reducer, uh, let me, I'm sorry, I'm sorry for being all over the place, I'm going to put the others too, so you see how, I'm going to be placing this too, all right. At the same time, the difference, the big difference between electroless nickel and silver is that this, you can keep using the silver many times over and over until the silver is spent. I mean, the, the nickel, you can use the nickel many times over and over um, until the nickel is spent with the silver in solution it's only once after you activate it after you activate the silver solution there's no going back they it, since it's a chemical reaction if you don't use it at a time it's it's you sold up so you're gonna we're gonna check we're gonna check how this look we're gonna be moving this around. You see? Now, this is only a demonstration. Okay? Now, this demonstration is to show you how it's possible. It is better to spray it, it's more efficient to spray it. Then is to then is to dip it. That's of course. But if you have a very large object that you don't wish to spray it, but instead of dip it, you can do it. Let's put it on the on the washing. This is this is to wash it to wash off the excess. All right. Now silver.
the silver. Silver. We're going to compare it with the nickel. Now, the, the ones on the left is silver. The one on the right is nickel. Now, uh, silver, it's, it's a, of a lighter color, but both of those are, they have a, 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 they have been metallized by silver and nickel. The process is very similar, but I believe nickel to be the superior one because it's the stronger and uh, you can keep using over and over until you spent all of the, 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 the nickel ions on the solution. Thank you.